How's it going, everyone? And welcome back to some more Danganronpa Another Despair Academy. Yes, I'm back! Finally! Oh. So, while I wasn't able to record any Let's Play content at all, Siri, my, my newest series, CWD, has been going up lately, and you guys seem to really enjoy it, so I wanted to start by saying thank you to the support. Uh, it's been a lot of fun making it. But finally, we're back with Danganronpa Another. Um, and you guys might notice that stuff looks a little different, sounds a little different as well. This is the official Chapter 2 to 6 story build by uh, Zephyrum, the, the public one. Um, I just liked how the UI looked, the user interface. It looks really cool, and I, I decided to change over to it. I just, lo I just carried over my save files, as you can see. And uh, yeah, uh, we're back. So last time we finished off Chapter 2, we found out the killer was Hayame Hatano. And uh, stuff really, really went downhill. Oh, hold up. Uh, I'll be back in just a bit. I it's been a while since I recorded. I don't know if the settings are right. Give me just one second. Alright, sorry. It seems to be all good. Let's just hop into it. I want to see what Chapter 3 brings. Um, I have to remind myself that um, Hanata's free time events are available. I can't forget that, like, at all. I cannot. Hanata's free time events are available. I cannot forget that. <laughs> let's just hop into it and let's keep playing the game. It's been a while. I'm excited to see what Chapter 3 brings. If it's like any other Chapter 3, there's gonna be two bodies. And one of them is probably gonna be my my precious baby girl. Oh god. Let's go. Uh, sure. Let's save. I was able to realize that when I was waking up, it wasn't particularly enjoyable. It didn't feel normal. I'm guessing this is Maeda talking. Uh, Yugi. Yuki. However, however strange it may sound, I hated opening my eyes again. Four of our friends have already died. I was still surprised that I could sleep. Oh, right. First time Maki died. Then Higa, who killed Maki in, in the attempt to escape, was executed by Monokuma. Yeah, this body discovery. Jesus Christ. Not long after, Tamari was killed by someone. Atano, who killed Tamori in order to save her friend, was also also was executed by Monokuma. Dude, that trial, man. That trial. Not only that, I'm worried about Kinjo's problem and Tyra's mental state. Everyone's getting more ferocious. Even if we're united, we're still getting hostile towards each other. It's not the time to be doing this. I have to meet with everyone right now. Morning has arrived! It is 7 a.m. Wake up time! Let's live a lively day! Ah, uh, it's been a while. Seems I woke up just in time. I don't open my eyes for a reason, but I have to force myself to get up. Yep. Yesterday, everyone was insane, and we were tired, so we couldn't talk properly, and we broke up. Let's try once more to talk about yesterday. First, let's go to the dining hall. We all decided to have breakfast together, so maybe everyone is headed there by now. Uh, that's not the song I would... Uh, that's not... <laughs> that's really not the song I would... Uh... <laughs> oh, God. I'm a monster. Okay. Uh, everything seems to be going fine. Hunky-dory. Let's go. Right, the interactable objects are still in Korean, which is fine. Oh look, it's you. Nakaru, hello. Incompetent. Welcome back. Huh? Did you mean to say did you mean to say hello? Huh? Never mind that. Hey, aren't you going to the dining room anyway? Yes, I'll go there first. <laughs> this this, th this makes things fun again. You go to the restaurant. <laughs> Why is Mikara saying that? If it's something she likes, I don't think it's very good for us. What what is what is she plotting? 
First, let's somehow persuade Kinjo, who has a very extreme mindset. And let's continue to convince Mikaru and Huehara, who act separately, and speak up, speak to everyone so they can cheer up. But I didn't realize at the time how naive and soft were those thoughts. Yeah, after yesterday, that's... Oh, yep. Huh? What is... It's not crazy. It's going to be fine, okay? You must be crazy, Kinjo! Not even with your remarks that insult Tyra for her... For her, Hatano had to sacrifice, uh, had to sacrifice herself for her. Hatano had to, and now you want to solidify the dictatorship? And no matter how you phrase it, being your own subordinate, we're not yours. Huh? Can I say anything? If you make things soft as before, you might get the same ending like Taira Kane. What are you saying? I realize this now. In this unusual situation, it wasn't necessary to unite from the beginning. Isn't that true even in society? Do you decide the law in consultation with the country and the people? It's not like that. There are always the highest people who make the law as they see fitting. That's nothing but social order. Iron Peak and Command people have to decide on their own, but the wor world works well. I see. So you want to remove their rights. Um, it's a shame I broke my shotgun last time. <laughs> Because it is the law set by people who know the law best than anyone else. It has to be this way. What do you want to say? Alright, she... Right, Mikako's talking a lot more since the chap since the class trial. In this school, I'm one of those higher people and you're a national people. Oh. better than anyone how to protect to uh, protect everyone and surviving here so you just want people to follow your words don't listen to this it's just crazy to even consider in fact Tomori and Hatano died after they said they would not make any victims if they followed him so you're saying I should resign because of last time I'll protect you perfectly so that you can even think of betrayal in order to do that you have to follow every order I give you Jesus Christ this man's insane you may not be able to afford any comments by our rules, but if you can keep it like that, it's a cheap exchange, right? Shut up! What is that for us? Who would want to hear what you have to say after all this? What is this? All six of you are not willing to obey me and are willing to kill any time? Yeah, it's a hundred times better to listen than to obey you! Wait a minute, what the hell is this? Maeda. Why are you all antagonizing Kinjo? I know we had a little argument yesterday. There was no hiding it, but you can't do this. Even if we all work together, it's not enough. But Kinjo is going to, the, to be the storekeeper from now on, and they are telling us to obey. Kinjo, is that true? Indeed, I will take care of you at your convenience and cope and, and cope with the too soft. Cope with the too soft. I'm thinking about this. And I'm going to take full control so that nothing like to, nothing, no situation like tomorrow does happen in the future. Your idea is not working! Why don't you get it? This just happened... Why, why don't you get this just happened and regret it already? Can't you tell? Real people are dying here! And even if we follow your words, there's no guarantee that no one will die. We're free to believe it or not, but at least I can ensure that your survival rate is much higher than playing among your friends. Oh, I see. A uh, friend, are you talking about like Mekharin? We don't need this at all. All of us won't even follow you. We'll act on your on our own, so don't even don't you even think about it. Kobashikawa, wait a minute. Fine, then from now on, I will treat you all as potential criminals. Eating. Eating. I think that will be the only time you and I will face each other as friends. In the end, that is what I'll choose. Kinjo! Maeda, what are you going to do? Will you ignore me too? No, me I I don't agree this should be done regardless of whether to follow that or not follow this. That's not what friends do. The answer is vague. If you make a choice, come talk to me. I'm going to leave. I don't want to be in the same place with these prospective criminals anymore. That's because you're a lot more criminal. Kamashika, what in the world happened? It's exactly what you saw. We gathered at the dining hall as usual, but he said, It's an extension of yesterday's work. I'll change the policy from now on. 
damn it, we're breaking apart one by one. We can't keep doing this! Oh, I can see the Tyre isn't here. Because Mikaru and Huehara originally went alone, but even so, why isn't Tyra here? Well, it looks like, like they're in their room, but when I call, they don't, they don't answer and they don't come out either. It's because Hato, their her best friend, died. I'm grateful we didn't die. Because originally, if it wasn't for Hot Nose's sacrifice and being executed, Tyra would have become the Blackened. It's no joke. And it's too much. Even if it was intentional or not, and Hot Nose sacrificed for everyone, injuries become like this. If he's so confident he won't die alone, leave him. Let's just get along together. Also, why did everyone get together here so quickly today? Usually, as soon as we listen to the Monokuma announcement, we come to the dining room. Does everyone promise to come except for me? Oh, uh, th th that's... I think I know where this is going, boys. It's because of the note, isn't it? Also, I love that sprite. It's a funny sprite. Hey, guys? I'm sorry, Maeda. It was something we had to hide, so I'll be honest here. We... I hope you don't hang out with us like Kinjo and Get Out. What? Yeah, exactly. We're sorry. Sorry, Maeda. Oh, no! I'm sorry, I was sleeping during this, so what's the reason? Why is everyone doing this all of a sudden? Even without Kinjo, we're mates who always acted together, right? You didn't know, but in fact, yesterday I spoke with Makara, Makara Uehara, and Kinjo, and everyone except you before returning to our rooms after the trial. First, the most urgent topic was Kinjo. It's rather a sequel because we came out before we argued about our argument. He came out with something first. The problem, however, was you, Maeda. Honestly, I'm still worried about how we should, how we should treat you. Why? What did I do to you guys? A secret note. I guess? Huh? Do you remember yours? Your secret note that Tamori was holding? Yuki Maeda might know the identity of the mastermind. Because of that? No way, you guys believe that kind of lie? It is not a lie. It was the truth when Kinjo read my secret note. When I was really young. I was teased a lot for being a tall person. And Atari seems to pee if, if he doesn't sleep with his papa. With his papa. You don't have to remember all of that. Did you hear them? I don't really know about the others because they're gone. But it's most likely true. Then, as written in your note, you will come to know the identity of the person who set this whole thing up. Well, I don't! How am I supposed to know the identity of this mastermind? Isn't this too early to conclude to be real? You're not really laughing at us behind our backs while saying that, are you? I'm not doing any of the sort! Why are you doing this? I'm not blaming you, but, um, we think you might be an imposter. Imposter? Don't say nonsense! Even one of us couldn't be involved in this- Oh, it's a fight! 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 Oh god, I need to stop for a bit. Uh, I knew that was gonna happen. Uh, the note was, like, glossed over in the classroom, and I was like, it ha- it's- It's 100% coming back to bite us in the ass, for sure. Like, there is not even a chance it won't. Um, but yeah. I wonder if that's true. Like, the notes usually are true. Like, Monokuma doesn't lie in motives. And that's worrying. Monokuma! What are you here for? Shoo, shoo! We're talking about something important right now. Yeah, you tell him, Satsuki. You tell him. Yeah! Fucking love Satsuki, dude. Eh, I was looking from the sidelines, but it seems like the story is going pretty wild. So I'm here to give you a hand. Are you here to cause more trouble? Far away from that, I'm here to talk about the imposter. The imposter? So they really exist? Actually, there is a mastermind that I planted even before Maki died. And that person is still alive and mixed in with you guys. Well, ain't that, ain't that nice. Can you really say that outright? What about it? It doesn't mean anything if I don't say who it is. And you guys seem to have reached a conclusion. So it doesn't really matter in the end for me. It's a lie. Something like that. If Monokuma's words are true, the most suspicious person is... 
Aida, it's him? Stop it, you guys! Why are you suddenly believing the words of Monokuma? Oh, well, I already told you, so I'll be on my way. I have to tell the others who weren't here, but... <laughs> All right, since you guys passed the class trial yesterday, I opened a new place again. I originally meant to be here to tell you this. Well, then, everyone give it a hard look and work hard on your investigation. We don't want to believe this, but the situation is getting difficult. The secret of that note is a lie. I'm trying to tell you that the trick mixing in false information with real ones. I actually got one from Kurokawa that was also a ridiculous joke. The secret note. Did you see it? Mikako Kurokawa may actually be a chatty person. That's what it was written. See, it's a joke. No, hold on a minute. You said you saw a secret note. Didn't we all agree to discard the note without looking at that time? Uh-huh. Right. Maeda, were you keeping it as a secret from us and you look at it alone? Yuki. You're kind of dumb. Sometimes. No, that's not... You didn't say anything to us. She mad. <laughs> Maeda, I'm disappointed. No, I was just... Maeda, I'm sorry. Really, we don't want to do this either. Sorry, I know we shouldn't be doing this, but... Yeah, that's honestly fair. I would do the same. Are we really doing this? We have to be hard. I'm sorry for Maeda, but if, if there's a chance they're the imposter, then there's no future for us. I'm worried about Tyra. I think our relationships are getting worse every day. Ever since Maki died, it started such a deep tension between us in order to escape from here. Let's move. We need to look into the new open place. That's right. If we find a clue to escape in the end, we don't we don't we don't have to fight like this. By the way, Kurokawa? Yes? Are you really talkative? Let's move on to investigate. Oh god, let's below the betrayer for the majority. For the majority? Throw away prime numbers. Uh, for the majority, not again! I thought we were done! Oh, I can hear it, guys. I can hear it. Help! Me? A traitor? That's ridiculous! Yeah, everyone is clearly confused now. Just that four friends are gone, and Monokuma is trying to pull a trap to destroy our group. We'll get back together in no time. No, let's do what we can. By the way, Monokuma said a new place has opened. Originally, I should do some research with everyone gathered at the dining hall to report on it, but now everyone is aware of everyone else, so this can't be good. Let's investigate as far as I can alone. Actually, before that, let's go to Tyra's room. I'm worried about breaking up. I'm worried about breaking up like that after yesterday. That's definitely not the song. Also, I'm guessing that's why, um... That's why my car was, like, super happy about him going to the dining hall. Little bitch. Your sire's room. Of course it's tough to go in. There's no angle of, to approach this, but I want to make sure they're safe. Hey, Tyra, are you inside? Like the others said, there's really no response at all. I guess she must really be hurt about Hatano. Tyra, I know it's very difficult, but I want to make sure you're sick. Can you give me an answer, please? Tyra. Leave me alone. Thank God, she's still inside. Okay, please come out when your mind is ready. The relationship between us is getting rather messy for everyone right now. Please don't overdo it. Make sure to eat rice at least. Oh yeah, there's also a place that Monokuma opened, so I'll be heading to investigate there. Without Tyra's brightness, it feels so discouraging. With Tyra by our side, the mood would improve a lot. Would Tyra react the same as everyone else? Me being the mastermind? Let's think about that later. A new place was opened. I'm curious to find out where, it, where was it opened this time. Let's start my own investigation. Alright, we run Zoom! We're on our own! 
This is actually kind of new for the protagonist. Because, like, nobody ever doubts Makoto or Hajime or even Shuichi. I, well, Kokichi does, like, throw around jokes about Shuichi being, like, really, really on top of things. But, like, it's very rare, honestly. There we go. New place. Uehara, did you sleep well? Why oh, though? Somehow. It seems the third floor is now open. Yes, it's true that every time the class trial ends, a new place opens. Did did you come also here to investigate because Monokuma told you? No, Monokuma didn't come, but I remember the last time it happened. So I just came here, and it was open too. I hope we find something on the third floor. However, Maya, what happened? And how you seem worse than everyone else. Ugh. <sighs> Twist, Uehara. Actually, it's just a misunderstanding for nonsense reasons. Nonsense reason? The secret note that Monokuma gave us last time. You recall it saying Yuki Maeda might know the mastermind. Tyra informed us at the class trial. Yes, I've been saying it again and again, but it doesn't seem to convince them. Because of that, everyone keeps, a, keep, keeps their distance from me. Now they think that I'm somehow the mastermind. <laughs> I can only laugh because it's a nonsense reason. Is it really? The others looked at my secret note and thought there might be someone in charge of this whole thing. But then Monokuma came out and told us directly, I don't know who it is, but the chances are it's one of us. However, it's obvious that all those things are lies. Monokuma is trying to break us down somehow. It's not even clear why I'm more the culprit behind this than the others. Mm, I see. So that's what happened. I think everyone knows this much. Because of this class trial- because of the class trial yesterday. I don't think everyone is sane yet, so I'm sure they'll recover soon. You better think carefully. If you don't have any special beliefs or reason, like me or Mikaru, it's better to act together. Will you keep going alone, Uehara? You still- you can still believe in us? There has never been a time where I couldn't believe. I still trust you. I'm just acting alone. I said this once, don't think too badly of it. I like Uehara. He seems to have his head in the proper place, honestly. He seems to be like super calm and super assertive about everything. I'm I'm glad. I'm glad there's a character like this in this game. It's okay, everything will be fine. By the way, don't you think it's better if we start our search somewhere than spend our time talking? It seems that my that you are alone right now. <sighs> it's so heartbreaking really. It sounds like bullying. But you're right. Okay, then I'll go check another place. If you find something, tell everyone. I'll be going. I forgot how to... Okay, oh, th this is the girl's bathroom. What the fuck am I doing? Okay. Dressing! Alright, there's nothing here. Nice. Ah, oh, look! Look who it is. I'm gonna avoid you for now, but I have to talk with you. Rubber gloves and bags are stored here. Probably the things that you put on when you're doing experiments. This is a chemistry lab. Okay, cool. I should have guessed because, like, the bottles over there. This. Hmm? Oh. What is this? It's dusty. Is this a book? It's really thick. Besides heavy, too. What is written here? On the cover of the unidentified heavy book that came out from the locker, it was written, Hope Speak Academy's 58th graduation album? Oh, okay. Okay. A Hope Speak, Hope Speak graduation album? Aida, what is it? Did you find something? Kinjo, take a look at this. It's the graduation album of Hope Speak Academy. What? Let me take a look at it. Stamp is from the real Hope's Academy. Maeda, where did you find this? In this locker in front of me. But why is the graduation album like this? What's the whose photos are in it? Is it Aki Hanzo? I think it's their album. How, how did you figure that out? Usually there's a picture of yourself on the back of the album cover. This is also the same. Well, here, take a look. What the fuck? What kind of motherfucking JoJo character is this? <laughs> what the hell? No, that looks cool, actually. Looking at the page that Kinjo pointed at, there was a, really a picture of someone from the page behind the cover, and it was written... Hisar Hisaragi Hanzo under the picture. 
So his name is Hanzo. Okay. A good looking person. By the way, who is he? Well, I don't know who he is, but at least I'm sure that this guy isn't the way he looks in this picture right now. Huh? Look at the cover again. It says Hope Speak, Hope Speak Academy's 50th, 58th graduation album. If you're a 58 year old, you should you would probably be 20 years older than us. Oh, that's right. Then this person must be an uncle by now. But why is such a person's graduation album in here? Hold up! Hold the fucking phone! I, I remember something at the end of the last class trial, like that whole talk from Monokuma to someone who was imprisoned. Did Monokuma say something to the effects of, you cannot age? Was he talking to that guy? Huh. I mean, I have no conclusive evidence that points to that, it's just... Weird. It's just weird that like a cutscene like that would happen, and immediate in the chapter immediately after you find something like this. It's... It's way too perfect. I don't know, just something... just... my brain just drifted for a second, anyway. I'm not sure, but don't you think this could be a clue to something? Apparently this person was the ultimate inventor. HELL YEAH, BITCHES! Muiruma's BACK! Just by looking at his achievements of graduation, it seems that he was, al was al has already established the theory of many electronic devices that are still in use. He was such a great person? Well, since he was an ultimate, it wouldn't, it wouldn't be that weird, right? Maeda, it's a new year. If this person is a graduated student from Hope Speak Academy, then of course he's already a mature person. Yeah, since Monokuma appeared and entered the school, we had completely forgotten about Hope Speak at the beginning. I was more curious than anyone else, so I was, I was very motivated to investigate the school completely. The situation is really scary, though. But isn't it weird? Even though the school has graduation album for graduates, wouldn't it be in a library or some archive room? Instead, it just pops out pops out in the, the science lab of all places. And that's not all. It's only Hanzo Kirasaragi's graduation album from the 58th graduates. Isn't it too strange? I don't think we have enough information, but it doesn't seem like mere coincidence. That this person's graduation album is in the school. Isaragi Hanzo. I feel there's something about him. Yeah, should we let everyone know? Fine, even though I treat the others as criminals and I don't get along with them. It's a good idea to share a clue that might help on our escape. However, if you, if you want to tell them, Maeda, I'll say this. I'm not going to meet them. I'll leave this graduation album to you. Take care of it. I'll go investigate elsewhere. Kinju is still here. I think this graduation album may contain an important clue, as Kinjo said. I'll let everyone know later. Ah, Kinjo, you're investigating over here. <laughs> oh yes, we just had a talk! What? Why? Oh, it's Maeda. What's wrong? You seem to be on edge. You're fine. I was talking to the other preliminary criminals for some useless business. Preliminary criminal. No matter the reason, huh? A few days ago, I thought the message was already received. I made it clear that I would not force you to say the choice was yours. These guys rejected me by making their own decisions. Then you should respond accordingly. If you want to get rid of me, do whatever you like, because I'll just respond accordingly. It hurts being bullied! Or should I say, I'm the one being bullied? What? What do you mean? That's, well... I get it. It's the suspicion of the secret note. I've said this again and again, that I'm not the one who, who knows this person. Believe me, it's me who wants to know who's the mastermind. Yes, you're not the traitor. I believe it. What?! Out of all people, this guy- uh... <laughs> Sense. Common sense does not exist. Huh? Why are you so surprised? Didn't you say you weren't one? It's not that. I wonder if it's so easy to believe. Uh, of course. It's not like I could be the only one person who knows them. Of course I'm certain. If Maeda was the traitor, there's no way you would interact with me. I guess that makes sense, yeah! What does that mean? Don't bother. By the way, those guys... They are really suspicious of people and rejecting you. They really have no idea. No, I think everyone's just confused right now. Soon you and I will be accepted by everyone once again. They'll come to reason. Maybe you don't know this, Maeda, but I'll never go back. I can't trust guys who broke up like that once again. In the end, there's always someone who wants to kill. 
That can happen! Well, how about this? Why not look at everyone in the eye instead of me? I'm going to cut off any relationship I had with those guys other than Maeda. No way! But why only me? Maeda, you helped a lot in the class trials. But Akuma said that there's actually an insider in our group. Yet only Maeda and I are the ones being treated as suspicious people. And you feel equal towards everyone, right? I don't feel- I don't sense any feelings of hostility towards me when I talk to you. That's right, but in the beginning I kept thinking that it would be better if Mekara and Uehara were united with everyone else. I don't really see how good that would be. Anyways, I don't intend to interact with criminals. But if I have something to say, I'll only tell you Maeda. Please keep that in mind. But if you look at how things are, how do you expect them to follow you like this? Do you hate it? Then would you treat me as a preliminary criminal? No! I'm saying you can do that as a friend! And they will never intend to murder! I'm kidding. Anyways, did you find anything on the third floor? Oh, well, there are many new open areas, but there are still things yet to be able to help in our escape. Oh, that's right. You're also investigating alone now. If it's, this, if it's the same as the previous floor, after the investigation is over, everyone should gather to report the investigation, like in the previous one. It is definitely better for a large number of people to report on the investigation. If you leave them alone, something will definitely happen. You should make sure that doesn't happen. Kinjo, are you really not going to return? I hate repeating this. You already know the answer. See you later. Kinjo is really a good guy if it was in a normal circumstance. But when a murder happens and a killer is revealed, he becomes a completely different person. Perhaps it's just a way of thinking that's been marked since childhood. In a twisted way that it took in a strange manner. This is all because of Monokuma that involved us in this situation. Yeah, I can definitely see that Kinjo has, like, good moral fiber, but god fucking damn it if I don't hate his guts during class trials. At least so far. Alright, let's see what else. Art room. Okay, let's see what we got here. Oh, look. Kurokawa can ignore me. Kurokawa, how's the investigation? Kurokawa, you're all you also think I'm a traitor? No. Do you believe in me? No. Which one is it then? Anyway. Alright, hi Mikara, what's up? Oh my incompetent. Are you here to investigate too? Yeah, right. Talkative as usual. Mekara really came to investigate, knowing that a new area opens every time when the class trials are over, right? Obviously. Or do you think I came here to appreciate the sculptures? Did you find anything? Hold it. What are you talking about? You said you could talk to me. Go away! Huh? Wait, come back for a bit. What's wrong? Why are you so un unenergetic? Hold on. Wait a minute. Originally, you would be the guy who's ta who's taking the lead in the investigation. So why have you come here alone? That's... Um? Oh... Did you fail your group? Failed?! That expression is so rude! It was correct then. But I'm puzzled. I don't know the reason why the others abandoned you. Haha, <laughs> that's it! In yesterday's trial, Yuki Maeda might know the identity of the mastermind. You lost all credibility, didn't you? How does she know all this? There seems to be no real secret to be kept in front of Mikaru. It's true. You're dying from something like that? The title of incompetent doesn't go anywhere. We have a timid boy over here. No. Right now everyone is confused about yesterday's words, so that must be it. I'm sure we can get back together soon. It doesn't matter if you know the mastermind or not. Anyway, I only need to survive. So you don't think I planned all of this? That I'm the imposter? Imposter? What's this relationship between the mastermind and the imposter? At the dining room earlier, then they said I might know who the mastermind is, so when I talked to the others and asked them to stop to stop that line of thought, Monokuma showed up, and he ran his own mouth and exposed that they really exist. I'm... Get out of my head! Get out of my head! I can't... No! Fuck! I'm sorry. I need to do this every time those words come up. It's a it's a defense mechanism. Also, give me just a second. I need to make sure. Okay, yeah, it seems to be good. I don't know why I didn't do this earlier, but like, yeah. Get out of my head. Just get out of my head, please. 
Among Us, there's one of us who planned all of this. Oh, ho, an imposter. Well, of course I thought there would be one. Come on, you don't really believe that, do you? There, there's some imposter. Stop, Yuki! <laughs> you fool, of course there is. Monokuma is basically a thing that doesn't lie about this. I don't know who it is, but it's fun. Let them do whatever they want. No matter what your friends do, I'll leave from this. I'll leave this place in the blink of an eye. That's tremendous confidence. Don't worry. I never thought you were the mastermind incompetent. I don't know the hidden meaning behind the man, but if a guy like you was some someone similar to me, wouldn't you be less less intimidated and not fun at all? Well, thank you for believing in me, but at the same time, it hurts my feelings in a different sense. Okay, Mister, you wasted my precious time investigating. Will you go out soon? But you were the one that called me back when I was about to leave. I wonder why. At least my car doesn't think I'm the traitor. You know, I'm starting to like Ray a bit more, honestly. Monokuma statue? Who made this garbage? Monocorn! Some, someone's plastic figure. Somehow, that look only causes discomfort. Monocorn! Is this Venus? Immensely big. I think it would suit in an art gallery rather than an art room. Mono coins! I live for the for the wealth. Anyway. Oh, what's this? A picture. Oh right! Chapter 3! That's right! Chapter 3 has a picture! Ooh, sorry about that. When I accidentally picked up the picture, I quickly froze in place. Oh, I see something. Huh? What? Hey, what is this? What in, what was in the what in the, what was in the picture was us. Not only me, but our friends that were already gone. Maki, Higa, Tomori, and Hatano too. All of them were smiling bright brightly and cheerful, as if to say the current situation is a lie. Why? Why? I don't remember ever taking a picture like this. Why am I here? If it was a picture of everyone else, every, everyone except me, at least I would be able to reason that everyone other than me had met before coming here. Also, I noticed that the picture is torn. <laughs> I'm starting to see something. As long as I have been photographed, and as long as I don't have such a memory of it, this photo looks so contradictory that I wasn't sure what to believe anymore. Besides, that's not the only weird thing. The picture was not in complete form, and part of it was torn as if only someone who was there was removed from it. What's wrong? Incompetent. Why are you making a fuss? Oh, Makara, take a look at this picture. What is this? Is anything recorded in it? When I was about to hand the picture to Makara. God damn it! Yeah! Dangerous? It's dangerous! This is super dangerous! Monokuma, what are you doing? Give me that picture back! Give it back? Why should I? This is mine, you know! I have to get it back! Hey, what kind of picture is that? Is Monokuma in that picture? That picture is... we're all in it! We are? Are you referring about me and the rest of them? Um, even though already deceased Maki, Hika, Hika, Tomori, and Hatano. You said I wasn't it too? Maenakuma, who saw the picture, would you remember? It was a view of having such a nice youth and completely enjoyable school life, right? With such bright smiles. Shut up! What's the trick behind that picture? I've never taken a picture like that. In the beginning, we met a few days ago in the first place. If I had taken a photo like this... Well, think for yourself! I'm just looking out for these photos because I dropped them and I came to retrieve them. <laughs> bye bye! What in the world happened? Hey, did you really see that right? I'm sure, but this is weird. Right after our first time meeting each other, we've been here all this time, and now we suddenly are in pictures? That's interesting if you're not lying. However, you don't recall either, Mikaru. Who told you to pretend to be close to me? I'm going to investigate. Don't follow me. She's puzzled as well. It's really awkward and true. Not a problem, but this clue just seems weird and important. I'll have to tell everyone soon. What's next? What is next? Uh, sorry. Oh, look. Aww. Give me that. 
Uh, the blackboards, they're not translated, sad moments. No, let's go here first. Ah, uh, sorry, again. I woke up like an hour ago. <laughs> Days off are the best. Hope Speaks Casino? Of course these two would be here. It's a pool table where you can play billiards. I've never played billiards that much. I didn't... It's billiards? Give me a second, guys. Okay, so I was right. It is billiards. Okay. I've never had to say that word before. But it looks interesting. Still, why is it in this school? Why is it in this school? That's a slot machine for sure. Of course it has a mono coin. Anyway, we need to talk with them. Ha 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 ha! How about that, Kabazing? I've won again! Damn it! I can't ad I can't admit it! One more game! Hey, what are you both doing? Oh, it's Maeda! Maeda has appeared! What should we do, Kobazing? What are you- Don't call me Kobazing anymore! Oh, you're playing poker. Is the investigation going okay? I don't care. Now you're not with us, either. We're suspicious of you in the first place. You think you can talk with us so easily? I know you suspect me because I can be an imposter, but the only one who knows best about me is myself. If you put that same logic into me, you can do it to another person, too. This is... It's never what an imposter would say. Don't be fooled! They might try to keep your guard off by saying stuff like that. Guys... I'm sorry, Maeda. Just until yesterday, we got along well. We've been together all this time. But I can't trust you because I care about that note. Besides, at that time, Monokuma is also aware of this. And because of his knowledge, there's no other person to doubt except you. Would you like to play poker, Maeda? Here there are a lot of fun games. Hey, that was a serious moment. Are you ignoring my comments? Poker. It's not the time for that. Also, I find it amazing that a casino is in this school. No, it's re weird rather than amazing, isn't it? Tatsuki wants to play with Maeda. Oh. Are you really suspicious of me or not? It, I'm, it's not as sure as when you spoke to Gindo. And that doesn't mean you're accepting, accepting me either. I know I said this a few times, but I'm innocent. I want you to know that. Maeda. So you're not gonna play poker. Hey, not when that scene is happening! I'm happy, but it's not the time. We have to get out of here. We'll find clues as soon as possible. Boo! Alright, Maeda, so how about this? Beat the two of us in poker. Then we'll stop doubting you and you go back together. What? Was your doubts about me light enough to be resolved if I win a game? Was I the only one being serious? That's not it. But it's still fun being with Maeda. Why don't we try a game for ourselves or whatever? This is a mood that doesn't balance the, that doesn't balance to be funny or serious. Oh, I don't know. Honestly, it doesn't matter if it's about a game of poker. By the way, how do we, how exactly do we play poker? What? You mean you never played poker? You should have played it with your friends. Poker is fun, but I never played with real money because I I don't have a gambling addiction outside of gotchas. But that's besides the point. <laughs> in elementary or junior, who plays poker in elementary school? Who plays poker in elementary? Who who does that? Who's the sick fuck who plays poker at like? Oh god. Sorry, I don't really like playing with cards that much. All right, I'll tell you the rules. So do it right. Let's start. I don't really know what would happen, but I decided to play with Iranami and Kubashikawa for a while. Ah, uh, that's nice. <gasps> oh wait, isn't he the ultimate lucky student? Uh, can I bet now? It's not real money. I have confidence in my hand. Shall we- shall I go? Then I'll begin. Ha <laughs> You're caught! My head, it's my victory! Full house! Ha 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 Only one pair here. Wow, no Satsuki! <laughs> Maeda, what's yours? Looking at your face, it's probably a triple at best, right? Sorry, it was a great game, but you can't win in front of a full house. Uh, well, I have 4k, so it's a 4 ha a 4 card play, right? Cause he just got fucking annihilated. <laughs> uh, I was like, wait, wasn't wasn't Yuki's talent ultimate lucky student? Yep, yep. 
There was like a whole plot. There was a whole plot point in Danganronpa One where Celeste wanted to play with Makoto. Pretty sure that might have happened in a free time event. I don't remember now. <laughs> Just, you lost. You lost, dude. That's so bad. Imagine losing with a fucking full house. Ouch! That's a loss, Kabazing. Oh, did I win? Hey, no, wait a minute. What's that? It makes no sense. How come those four cards pop, pop out there? I don't know. I just did what you told me. Beginner's luck. It's just beginner's luck. I can't admit this. Again, again, this isn't valid. Wow, he got fired up. I love these two. They have such a good dynamic. All right, let's see what happens this time. <laughs> All right, it's time for bed. Let's go. Let's flush. Ha, <laughs> who's the winner? Another one pair. When Maeda arrives, suddenly my hands just got worse and worse. Oh, uh, wait a minute. Can you explain what my hand is? I'm not sure what this is. You got a royal flush, didn't you? They got a fucking royal flush, didn't you? <laughs> huh? What is it? Let me t let me look. M M M Maeda, you. Holy straight flush. Is it strong? Nonsense! Did you cheat? Did you malip? Did you manipulate the win? Huh? Dude, he he's the ultimate lucky student. Shouldn't he? Shouldn't that raise kind of a few red flags? <laughs> a few, just a few. I don't even ask for all of the red flags. Just a few red flags should be raised from that. You're playing poker with the ultimate lucky student. First, you get four cards on the first round, then you get a straight flush the next one. Where did you sit down talking like a to like a lottery ticket? Why are you mad at me? It just happened to me. Kamazing, it turns out Maeda came to help speak because of that. That? You mean my ultimate lucky student talent? But I don't remember having this talent at all. The ultimate lucky student. Unbelievable. Did I touch the feathers of a sleeping lion? Where, where's the feather in a lion? Maeda, are you often lucky at winning games or something? Uh, no, this is the first card, the first card game that I play with the luck element added. To be honest, I haven't played many board games. My favorite games are role-playing action type, or similar kind. My man! RPGs are the best! This is ridiculous! You just updated to Gambler now! I'm not really sure about that. I don't know. By the way, Kobazin, you lost, so you gotta keep your promise, right? It looks fun to talk to Yuki, too. But I mean, he... Sorry, give me a mo- give me some moment to- give me some time to think. <laughs> he didn't even do the walk cycle! My man zoomed out of there. Holy shit, that was awesome. He ran away. Kobazin is also not very honest. Don't worry, Yuki. If he's in that state, he'll definitely stop being suspicious of Yuki. And he will come to apologize soon. Do you have any doubts about me? Nope! In the first place, I hate complex stories. Yuki's being pushed against us by a subtle psychological warfare so... <laughs> so annoying. Oh, uh, you are definitely best girl. Well, actually... Kanata's best girl. You are... also best girl. Shit, this is we This is tough. Oh, god. So I decided to think that Yuki is just Yuki. Anyways, what to do? Kabazing and us. Wanna play another game? Oh, not right now. We need to continue the investigation. Yeah, when the confusion subsides, I'm sure everyone can reunite again. And it does- and it goes without saying, getting out of here, too. Boo! Until my Aida came, I was having fun kicking Kabachikawa's cards. I'm really sorry, but you should- you should investigate at least, too. <laughs> we just absolutely destroyed her. What? Don't talk to me right now! I can't see you! Whatever you say. Uh, what's left? Probably this, right? Oh, hi, Otori. What's up? Oh, Maeda! Well, isn't nice the new area- not the new area open? Once I entered the classroom, I was checking the windows, but it's no use. They're all covered with iron plates. I think the same goes for upstairs. Ugh, <sighs> that's right. But Otori, weren't you suspicious of me because of the saying that I'm an imposter? Ah, yeah, I forgot! Oh boy, being aware of it by the enemy, dangerous tongue, dangerous! Don't think I'll get along with the guy who sides with the mastermind! 
you said that, but you spoke first. I can't even deny it, but I want you to know that this is an misunderstanding. I want to believe in you too, but I'm sorry. Well, ain't that nice. A large locker. I think you can store anything in it. I opened, but it was empty inside. Oh, that's a lot of sh oh, Why can't I go over the table? The smaller, the smaller locker. Very old. I don't need to open it. I can see through the, the inside, inside of it through the gaps. Okay. What else is there to see? Is there anything else that opened? Or am I just missing something? Oh! Wait, I've been here. Yeah, the science lab. I don't know where I'm supposed to go. Did something else open up here? Uh... Uh-oh. Well, there's nobody in the classroom. Did I miss something in the casino? There isn't anyone else here. Alright guys, I'm gonna cut and I'll be back once I find whatever I need to find. Uh, until then. Ha ha! I have found it! I was like, oh right, in Dying Room 1, nurse, the nurse's office opened up in Chapter 3 too. And I was like, oh yeah, I need to find Kan- no, it started like, I need to find Kanata. She's like the last one I haven't found, besides like, maybe Yamaguchi, but I need to find Kanata. Um, and I remember- oh right, the nurse's office. Yep, there they got- there they are. Alright. Maida, what about- What's the matter? I came to investigate because a new area was open. Right. Look, do you still suspect me? I know it shouldn't be like this, but uh, I can't decide right now, so... Let me watch the situation and judge it for myself. I'm sorry. I'm really sorry. That's fine, I guess. That's- that's reasonable. What about you? Maida. Everyone but me came to investigate. I'm sorry. I want to do something about this, but everyone is so stubborn. As for me, I don't doubt you, Maeda. It's okay. I think it's because everyone is confused now. Oh, look at her. She believes. Also, I see the infirmary is open now. Oh yes, there aren't many exceptional tools, but I think I can do first aid right away. And after the class trial yesterday, Monokuma would have, would have opened the infirmary, so... Hatuno would get treatment. Yes, originally Hatuno should have been treated in here. But she couldn't because she was executed. Oh no. Cheer up, Inori. At least in the future we can treat the injured, right? Hatuno wouldn't want us to be sad either. I guess you're right. Then I'll have to let everyone know later. If you get if you get hurt, always come to the infirmary. Oh and about about you. Sorry if I repeat this, but I'm really sorry. I think everyone will change their minds soon. Please be patient until then. <laughs> you are so pure! <laughs> you remind me so much of Chihiro. And Kana. Both. Both is good. Both is good. God damn it. Sorry. I needed, I needed, I needed to let that out. It looks like I searched every new place opened. I decided to return to the student dormitory. I saw, I saw that typo. Student dormity. That, that's funny, actually. Yeah, once the investigation is over, everyone doesn't seem to have solved their doubts yet, but I want to share the information we gather. In this case, if Kinjo had been there, he would have gathered the others with leadership and know that Kinjo is being rejected by everyone. But even so, the new area survey needs to be done in groups. We can't make up for the parts that individual searches have, misses, have missed, and things could end up really bad. Kanata! Maeda, I found you right away. You found me? Well, Kurokawa asked me to gather everyone. Not only Maeda, but also Mekaru, Uehara, and Kimjo. Are you saying that we should all report about the investigation? There's another reason for that, but I think there's something to tell to everyone. Anyways, I'm glad I found you right away. I'm going to call the rest of Kimjo's group, so please get to the dining room first. That smile! Lights up my day. What is Kurokawa doing? Well, at least this is good thanks to her. Thanks to her, we are able to report our findings together. And this kind of event that everyone gathers us, uh, gathers, it builds us. And uh, 
And then it becomes a stone to unite us again. Good, let's go there at once. Alright, let's save. Probably not gonna record for much longer. Since I do have stuff to do afterwards, unfortunately. You know, the life of a... The life of a master's degree student in his final semester, bro. <laughs> it's almost done. Afterwards, I'm gonna get a job! I'm gonna be engineer! Put these vents out of here. Anyway. <sighs> okay, let's go in. No, why am I taking a deep breath again? Well, it's only natural. Waiting for a while, I saw Uehara coming in. Afterwards, Mikaro and Kinja with frowning expressions. They all came to the gathering. Okay, this is gonna be interesting. Why do I think it's been years since everyone gathered like this? It's kind of, it's kind of happened. No, wait a minute, not everyone. Tyra's not here, didn't you call Tyra? I kept calling in Tyra's room, but she still doesn't feel like coming in. Well, heart wounds don't heal that easily. Let's leave her in a bit more space. It's nice to leave her alone, so why don't we make the rice on time? It doesn't seem to come out from the morning. Is everyone, is anyone available? What the fuck? If you call to talk about this, I'll leave. I agree, let's talk about the issue quickly. What are you talking about? I just wanted to put you all together and talk about the investigation, put everything in order. Why don't you report about your investigation on the second floor of scooby -Yos? I don't think it would make much difference even if you gather everyone now. By the way, you guys, if something interesting like this happened, happens, you should, you should have let me know. The psycho police was finally rejected. <laughs> oh, I said that at the trial and finally it happens? Oh, it's so funny. I wasn't rejected, but I was fed up with myself. And if you don't want to listen to me, then why don't you go out? I think we would be better without the couple over there. No, it's better to do the report everyone, with everyone together. Right, come to think of it, you were the one who asked everyone to gather? Now, why, what did you call us for that you had some... What, what did you call us for? Uh, uh, what did you call us for? What, what is that something you have to say? I'm not asking for an investigation report or being with all these people here. First, report the investigation. Everyone needs to know. That's okay, but Kurokawa, you seem to have a motor running in your mouth these days. Yours are coming out more frequent now. Uh, ignoratory. First, as Kurokawa said, let's do the investigation reports at first. <laughs> well, it's been a while. I mean, gathering together like this and report on the investigation. If we do together, we can share information. Oh, Then I will tell you from my... Me and Yamaguchi from the infirmary room. Huh? Infirmary? There was no such place in the third floor. That's because it's on the first floor, not the third floor. The infirmary. Oh, yes. First, there was nothing unusual. There were many items that were easy for first aid, such as various medicines and bandages. There was no clue regarding the escape, but the infirmary is still open, so please come to me if you get hurt, because I will always be in the infirmary. Red flag! Red flag! Please don't do this to me! Dude! Don't. That's a major red flag. Telling what, where you're gonna be at all times? That's a major red flag, Kanata. Don't do that! So there was also an open place on the first floor. I went to the third floor directly. That's right. Me and Kobazin found a casino on the third floor. C casino? What is that? It's literally a casino. Slot machines, pool tables, roulette cards, roulette games, darts, cards. Why did I say roulette cards? There were many things you could play there. In a casino in a school? Isn't it too much? I think it would be nice to have a break. You can laugh and play in there. And you're not doing it right. Our, pur our purpose here is to get out of here. There's no reason we'll like it just because our life in here is getting rich. If you want, you could be a little more positive. If the others were here, Maki and Higa, I'm sure they would be would have been happy. Well, there was no clue to escape there either. Well, I went around the classrooms and checked the windows, but they were still covered with metal plates. So it was the same too. Was that everything on the third floor? There was an art room. Art room for a school life facility. What was in there? Nothing much. Oh, hey, would you mind if I speak for a second? Actually, I found something weird in the art room. Something weird. I picked up a picture that was on the floor of the art room. In that picture, we were all in it. Oh, you were? Everyone here, and Tyra in her room. And all who aren't here Maki, Higa, Tomori, and Hatano. What? How is that possible? I don't remember taking a picture with you. No, I've never taken a I've never taken a picture since I was born. 
That's weird, though. If we're the owners of that picture, <clears throat> didn't we meet for the first time at Hope Speak Academy a few days ago? That's why I mentioned it's weird. Maybe I'm confused, but everyone seems confused, too. What? We have a picture that we don't remember? Did we lose our memories or what? Besides, there was another strange thing. That photo was taken like a group photo. Like, on a school trip, but the center was torn. The way I saw it is as if someone was in that spot and they were deliberately ripped. Someone else besides us. Were we not 15 in total? Is it- No way, the mastermind? That person who controls Monokuma trapped us in here! Wouldn't it be the person who controlled him, the one ripped off from the picture? Yo, Danganronpa one. <laughs> Why am I like this, bro? I'm just so stupid most of the time. I just turn off my brain, like... The process for me, recording is... Brett, head empty, no, no thoughts, head empty, just voice act, and say stupid shit. Oh, and cry when your favorites die, because of course. Anyway, oh, I don't remember taking that picture in the first place, but are you saying we took a picture along with a mastermind? The existence of the picture is itself weird. Maybe Mr. Monokuma made it himself? I can't think of anything other than that. Or maybe Maeda is lying. What? Are you lying, Maeda? I, I can't be! There's no reason to lie! And no reason to lie to your backs either! Maybe to confuse us or something? Hey, um... Hey, Ray, I know you don't really like us, but, uh... This would be the time where you jump in and literal- and say that you literally saw Monokuma yank the picture out of our hands. Just saying. Oh, I can fully trust Maeda yet. Sorry. No way! This is an investigation report, right? I said what I found! Why do you suspect this? That's not good. But if you're dissatisfied, would you mind just showing the picture? That's not possible. Monokuma took it before I could do anything else. Monokuma did? Then there's no evidence. You really lied, didn't you? That's really troublesome. I trust my friends, you know. What? If you don't know a thing, then stay quiet. In a secret note, Maeda turned out to be aware of the mastermind. And he could be all- it could be for all we know. Because I fell asleep during all that. I'm not so sure. I'm not particularly on his side, but the picture is real, so beat him- so beat the useless deaths already. Yes! Thank you! I knew this was gonna happen! I'm actually thanking her. Jesus Christ. How low have I sunk? You- how do you know that? It was in the art room when Yuki Maeda picked up the photo. <gasps> she didn't call me incompetent! Oh, I'm flattered. However, even though I don't know the contents of the picture, it's true that she picked up something similar to a picture. Mekaru, stop. I just prevented the story from going down the road by fucking thanks. Damn. She cursed. Damn! Well, even if what Maeda said is true, um... Is it just Monokuma's manipulation? I can't help it after discussing things that I'm not sure about. Let's just skip ahead and listen to the other investigation sites. I agree, it's not really a clue that can help us escape anyways. But are there any inve other investigations besides this one? Oh, there's one more. The new classroom. We have a science lab on the third floor. A room for science, you say? Well, there are several experimental devices, drugs, but that's not what matters. Everyone take a look at this. I showed everyone the album book I found on the science lab. Ah! Dusty! Ah, 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 <laughs> ah. That's... Speak Academy's 58th graduation album. 58? Were they... Were there more seniors? It's the graduation album of one person by the name of Kurosagi... Kisaragi Hanzo. I know, he must be an old person. Kisaragi? Oh, she knows him! Oh, she knows him! Oh, the pieces are falling together, boys! I think I hit the jackpot with my earlier remark. I think I hit it! She knows him, for sure. What's wrong, Kurokawa? Is he an acquaintance of yours? What's wrong about it? Who's this person? Also, you said this old person's album was in the science lab? That's a mystery. Besides, there are no other seniors. It was only this guy alone. What are you going to do, psycho policeman? You've been getting a sick you've been getting a sick look since we began. Why is that? <sighs> Shut up. It's just that I don't feel the need to participate with preliminary criminals. Well, even so, Kinjo, 
If you found a clue to escape, it's important to share information. Forget it. They don't want to escape with us together. By the way, this graduation album is completely- is really confusing me. This is everything, right? This is all we found- I found on the third floor- on the third floor. There's no clue to get out this time. This doesn't seem to be a clue to escape, but is it okay if I take a minute of your time? Oh? What is it, Uehara? I actually found something in an empty classroom. A phone! This is a cell phone? It was in an empty classroom desk drawer on the third floor. I was going to tell everyone, but it worked out in the end. Since we all gathered here like this. A sly phone! It's boring! It's a 2G phone in the world these days! Damn, 2G, imagine. But it's not important. Whether it's 2G or 3G, because it's a mobile phone, you can talk, right? Why am I doing this voice for him? You can talk, right? We need to contact the outside as soon as possible. Request for a rescue. No, wait. As far as I can tell, I carefully guessed that in this situation, that cell phone is most likely broken. No, it works fine. The battery, however, is low, but there is a charging cable next to where the phone is, so you can use it any time. Decline foresight. Actually, I would have believed... I would have believed Satsuki, because usually stuff like this is broken. Is that true? Is it working? That's indeed great. It's the most helpful discovery so far. The call hasn't been made yet. This is the first time I turned it on in front of you guys. Mr. O'Hara, call someone quickly. We might be able to get out. Understood. As O'Hara responds, they start using the phone. Huh? Well, what are you doing now? No, I mean... How? How do you... <laughs> <laughs> I knew it, dude! Oh, that's so funny. He doesn't know how to use a cell phone. What? Are you an illiterate person? Have you lived in the mountains or something? That's a bit harsh. Treating a strange person just because they, they can't use a mobile... Treating a person sort of strange just because they can't use a mobile phone. It's all good. At least you know how to turn it on. <laughs> Give it to me. I'll try calling. Sorry, if you could please do. That's funny, dude. Uehara handed over the mobile phone to Yamaguchi, and everyone, even Kinjo and Mikaru, paid attention to Yamaguchi. Of course we are. If we can get out of here, we no longer need to doubt each other, and the anxiety about when the murder will happen will disappear. While everyone was so nervous about and watching Yamaguchi operating the cell phone... This... its signal doesn't reach. What is this cheap gat comic like ending? What do you mean by signal? Isn't a cell phone a machine that can call from anywhere? Don't worry about it and stay quiet. That's unfortunate. I thought we might be able to get out of from this situation finally. Hey, Muscle Pig, give it to me. Muscle Pig? Okay, here you go. Mikaru, what are you trying to do? Mikaru picks up the cell phone and starts to fiddle with it. It's a problem in this area, so that's the issue. Everything else is working fine. Except for how dusty it is. What interesting thing is, she is the original owner of this thing. Original owner? Is it from one of the students at Hope Speak Academy that lost her or something like that? Look at this and repeat that sentence. Mikara manipulated the phone for a bit and then she showed us that the screen for everyone. What appeared on the screen was... Oh, it's Maki's! Oh my god, dude! So that's what she meant by she. Oh. Maki? This is Maki! Why is Maki's picture on that phone? The face that smile that, smi that was smiling so brightly with friends on the screen was the figure of Kyoka Maki that we all know so well and that we already have been unable to see in this world anymore. Why you ask? That's because the owner of the cell phone is Kyoka Maki. <laughs> Huh? Maki, she brought her cell phone. No, then that would mean we brought them too. But they disappeared after coming to this... To this school. Sorry, guys. The image folders are open, but Nero says that the password is needed for the data. Or the data will be corrupted and erased. Well, it's a big deal, so here, take it. Oh, right. Maki's cell phone. If Maki was alive, we could have asked about her. Asked her about it. Hey, but don't you think something is amiss? If you think about this carefully, Hope Speak is out of signal from the outside. It doesn't work because of all the iron plates on the blocked entrance? But Hope Speak Academy is in the middle of Tokyo, right? 
A simple blockade would lead to a lockdown. That means a currency break. What exactly happened to us? Chris, let's hold on to this. Take care of your phone. Well, what can we do? No phone calls and the data could be destroyed. Oh, Haran just found it, right? Then keep it. Touch your, cell phone, touch your cell phone and study it. Don't become the illiterate anymore. There's no inconvenience if you know how to use a cell phone. But if you want me to keep it, I'll have to learn. So please tell me what I need to do. In the next investigation to report... It, it, we're done. Yeah. I guess we're done then. Eventually, we can f if we can find a clue to escape from here again. Well, let's not give up yet. If we keep looking, something else might come out. I don't want to hear that from a fake friend. You still doubt me? I am not a traitor! <laughs> now, the investigation report is over, so let's go ahead and speak. The real reason for bringing us here. Mikaku Kurokawa, you did this calling, right? You have something to say to everyone. Speak. I put I put up with the disgust and stayed in one place with the preliminary criminals to this point. So I hope you get your I, you, I hope you get to your speech soon. See what he's talking about now? I feel the same too, honestly. I think they, doing this now is a waste of time. So would you like to tell us quickly what is what is what this is all about? The reason I called you here. I need to show you all something. I think everyone should look at this. What do you want to show us? Tyre is not here, so it's everyone. This way. Follow me. We decided to go after Kurokawa first without knowing the reason. Is it because Kurokawa without a word spread wants to... What? What's this? Okay. She wants to show it. Yeah, let's go. Okay, we're at the... Kurokawa, isn't this the warehouse? There's something here. Among you. Some of you might want, want to ask me, don't you? When we began the class trial yesterday, the reason for being late it was related to this. I'll tell you why. I was late. Someone please look at the bookshelf in front of me. Huh? Why all of a sudden? Yesterday in the dorms, I went to look for anything. To investigate. While wandering around, I found this. I heard a person's voice from behind it. You heard a human voice behind the bookshelf? <laughs> Ghost! There's something behind this. Hey, man, go ahead. What is in there? All right, let's see what it is. We were surprised by Kurokawa's words, and remo we removed the bookshelf in front of us. And what we found was... Oh, hello! This is... What was behind the bookshelf was not a hard wall, but a large hole enough for a person to fit through, and a staircase leading into it. There's a hole in the back of the warehouse! Besides, there's even a staircase going down? Yes. This staircase, where does it lead to? You heard the human voice coming from here, Kurokawa. Where, was it a voice from the outside? This is an exit to get out, an exit, right? I'm, just not, I'm not sure if we're leaving. However, this looks dangerous. Is it okay to get up, go in? It seems obvious that it leads to a new place. If that's the case, we have no choice but to go. We have been checking in and out of the warehouse all the time, but a new place has only been, rediscover uh, only been discovered just recently. I thought this might be the exit we were all reaching for, so my body started to get excited more and more. But then, when everyone stopped hesitating and tried to step into the secret entrance... <laughs> hey! No! Do not enter! Not here! Monokuma! You know the place you're trying to enter? This is a no-entry zone, got it? No-entry zone? Hello, this place, we trapped very fierce creatures with sharp claws and very crazy, too! There's billions of them down below! Billions? Why are such terrifying creatures in the school? Where does this child's imagination go? Since you said that, now I have to go further down. Get out of my way. No! Mr. Monokuma has a duty to keep you all from danger. Calling it right now, this is where the fucker is keeping that guy. It's like, if you go down there, it'll be a suicidal act. Are you fine with that? Don't lie, we heard from Kurokawa that she heard human voices inside. You can't expect to hear voices from such dangerous creatures. I agree. Or is that an exit that you prevent us from leaving? Is that it? Oh no! You can't really can't enter here! There's a very dangerous creature! Just move already. I can't use violence because of the school rules. Oh, could that be it? Maybe the, Mon the reason Monokuma is so nervous means that there's definitely something below. <laughs> well, if you really want to go down there, I won't meddle. But I warn you all, you better pay attention to the ceiling of the stairs while going down. 
when I listened to Monokuma and looked inside for a moment, I noticed a faintly long metal flashing. That's some kind of weapon, right? A machine gun! Pretty, right? If you go down there and the machine gun, the machine's target may turn red and it will turn you into a honeycomb. If that's fine with you, go down. Stand the toy. Aha! I told you not to do that! I'm doing this to keep you out from danger! I've said this clearly already! It looks like there's really an exit though, and is there something that could be the root of our situation? I don't know about what Miss Makara is talking about, but I don't go down anyway. I'll stand still until you get out of here, and you won't tell me not to do it! What do we do? What if there's an exit here? We can't leave anyway, because Tyre is not here. We can't leave, not now. That is true. Well, it's regrettable, but now we have to retreat, right? Go back then! What is that? It increased one more? This is an after image. It's so fast and it looks like too. I'm the gatekeeper of this place now. We can't help it. Let's leave. Let's leave for now. Yes, I had, I had enough income to know that there was something important down there. I don't know anything of what you guys mean at all! Well, let's do that. Kurokawa, will you be okay? Yeah. Damn it, Monokuma only interferes when it's really important. I really wanted to know what was down there. I'm calling it! It's the guy! Like, Kurokawa heard the conversation that happened at the end of chapter 2, like before the class trial, I imagine. So Monokuma was there before the class trial? Or maybe after the class trial, I don't know. It doesn't matter, but like, maybe that conversation was after the class trial and Monokuma went there before the class trial while the investigation was going on. Um... That guy doesn't age, said by Monokuma himself, and I bet it's the guy we found in the album, and he's locked down there, and he's gonna show up at some point in the story, and he's gonna be the 16th student lying hidden somewhere in the school, the one they call the ultimate something, well, inventor. Watch out for him, or some shit, I don't know. I'm, I'm calling it, and Kurokawa's related with him somehow. But as Inori said, there must be something very crucial that, Mo that Monokuma reacts this way. We'll look into that sometime later. As I thought about that and left the warehouse, we went back to the dining room. Alright, that was useful. Well, what do we do now? Kurokawa's in that state now. What do we- what to do? There's no way out. It's clear there's something in the hidden stairs of the warehouse. If we- if only we had a chance to look, we could search downstairs. I'll say, wasn't it wrong that everyone went together? Why is that? That's gotta be it. If, the, if there are imposters among us, isn't that an attempt to escape with the traitor? Of course, you will be caught by Monokuma. Atari, why are you looking at me while you say that? Stop it. Even if there's a person who is an imposter, none of us contacted Monokuma. It's most likely that Monokuma was probably watching the surveillance cameras. Oh, right. I almost forgot about the existence of those surveillance cameras. Plot point for the class trial for sure. Uh, then we should be careful when talking about important things in the future. Hey, lunatics. Now this is all over. I'll go. If you are not sure of some fighting, don't call me. Now Kinjo doesn't want to spend time with anyone. Leave him. That guy's no good. Not just Kinjo. You too will distress someone. Someday you will distress each other. I'll see you next time, friends. I'll be taking my leave as well. If you need the mobile phone, please speak to me. Everyone, all of us are shaking. Shaken. The situation was increasingly moving in the opposite direction from what I wanted. Maeda, are you going to stay? I guess you still can't believe me. Rather than not believing, how do I say this? You have seen it, haven't you? He's a liar, even though there's definitely something downstairs. You all believe in my secret note written by Monokuma more than me. The situation which you all which you all doubt me for right now is according to Monokuma's scheme. Just a little. Give us time to think a little. I'm sorry, Maeda. It seems to be in vain to be with everyone now. I have no choice but to be avoided for now. I hope you make a wise choice, because I am always the one who know. I, I'm always the one I know who I am. Since you're my friends, I'll believe in you. Powerful, actually. Kinjo's avoiding us. 
Mikaro and Uhuehara are still around and everyone doubts me. Tyra doesn't even want to come out of her room. This is the worst possible outcome. Still, I shouldn't lose hope, right? The secret staircase in the warehouse. If I believe there's a clue to escape, there is still a ray of hope in this situation. If I can leave this place with everyone, all our worries will be resolved. Let's wait for a chance. I cannot lose hope. Morning, free time event. Uh, we're actually ending off here, boys. And girls, and everyone in between. Ah, it's good to be back. I, I say this almost at the end of every single one of my, uh, of my uh, videos now. But it's good to be back. The beginning of this chapter is a lot more interesting than anything. Maybe, okay. I'd say that the beginning of this particular chapter 3 has been better than all of the others, the other games I've played. Maybe with the exception of... Ugh, I don't know, dude. I liked when the third island was revealed in Danganronpa 2. Danganronpa in chapter 3 was kind of... Okay, I was gonna say it was kind of meh, but then I remembered. Right, Alter Ego. Um, so that was really good too. You know, it's funny because Chapter 3 always starts really strong, but has a tendency to drop off. This one so far, it has a really interesting premise. The distrust of my head over the note. It's the first time we see a protagonist in this situation. I like it. Anyways, folks. That'll be all for now. Thank you all for watching. If you liked today's episode, consider leaving a like and subscribing if you are new to the channel. I almost said my Twitch outro there for some reason. Uh, if you want to be notified of future uploads like this one, hit the little bell. You know what to do. Also, if you want to join my Discord server or follow me on Twitch, link to both will be in the description below. Guys, that is all for me. Stay safe out there as usual. And until next time, oops, I hit my microphone. Peace!